The following will guide you through the installation of the Crosstex Dentapure DP365M municipal cartridge. You'll need the following tools to perform the installation. It is recommended to keep these tools within arm's reach as you work. You'll need an adjustable wrench, a set of pliers, scissors or knife, a Phillips screwdriver, a bucket or similar receptacle to catch water, the included Dentapure installation kit, To begin, you'll need to locate and close the water shutoff valve for the unit and set a pressure of 45 PSI on the regulator. Next, find a suitable location for placement of the municipal cartridge. Keep in mind that the cartridge could be mounted or freestanding inside the junction box. This location should be able to fit the cartridge while avoiding putting pressure on other tubing pipes or fittings. Placement should also avoid causing kinks in the tubing and be near the water regulator. Now it's time to prepare the cartridge. Using Teflon tape to ensure water tightness, install the included polyflow fittings and tighten with your adjustable wrench, taking care not to over tighten as this could lead to cartridge damage. Next, you'll connect the water line to the Dentapure cartridge. Measure your water line from the regulator to ensure you will have enough tubing to reach both the inflow and outflow sides of the cartridge. Double check that the water is turned off and then cut the tubing using scissors or knife. Unscrew the small locking nut from the inflow side of the cartridge. Refer to the arrow on the cartridge for flow direction. Slide the brass nut over the tubing to be connected. Push the tubing over the brass fitting and ensure that it is completely seated. Tighten the brass nut back onto the fitting. Ensure tightness. Prior to installing the outflow side, you'll need to run water through the cartridge to purge air and remove any extra carbon particles. This will prevent the particles from entering the dental unit. To do this, slowly turn on the water supply until water is flowing through the cartridge. You should see the particles clearly and they will dissipate quickly. Return the water supply to the off position and attach the outflow side of the cartridge. Finally, turn the water supply back on and activate hand pieces to purge any air that might have entered the system. Check for normal water flow. That's it! the dental unit is now ready to be returned to service. For instruction for use, go to www.dentapure.com. For additional Dentapure information, go to www.crosstext.com slash pureh2o.